figure this error message in Ready Dead Online, also known as Ready Dead Redemption 2. And the error says, unable to connect to Roku Star Game Services at this time. Please try again later with an error code which has been provided here on the screen. Now, what causes this error? This error usually occurs when there is a connection problem with the Roku Star Games servers. Now, you can try the steps here below as some people will resolve this issue. Now, try connecting to a different network such as using a phone hotspot or a different Wi-Fi network and ensure that you are not connected to a VPN. Sometimes, if your ISP provider has issues, you need to change network by connecting to a different network such as using a phone hotspot or a different Wi-Fi network and ensure that you are not connected to a VPN. Now, if you are still facing again the same problem, make sure you are logged into your Rockstar Games account in the launcher, then try launching the game from the Rockstar Games launcher and your issue should just be resolved. So if you don't have the Rockstar Games launcher, you can download it, but make sure you are logged into your Rockstar Games account in the launcher, then try launching the game from the Rockstar Games launcher. If you have mods, make sure that all mod files are removed. Sometimes, if you have corrupted mod files, can cause lots of issues. So make sure to remove all the mods. Now, disable mods one by one to identify conflicts. You can start deleting every single file that has a different date than the rest of the files. If it still doesn't work, you can try removing this script hook rdr2.dll and din put 8.dll, which will disable the mods. Now, mods are located inside your game folder. You can go to your Steam library, right-click on Red Dead Redemption 2 on Steam, then go to ma select Manage, then select Bruce Local Files. This will open the installation folder for your game. Then try removing this script hook rdr2, which is script hook Red Dead Redemption 2.dll and the input 8.dll, which will disable the mods. Now, if you're still facing again the same problem, your last resort will be to try reinstalling Rockstar Games Launcher. Now, if you've re restored Rockstar Games Launcher, but you're still facing against some error, then sometimes it's not you, the issue may be on the end. The Rockstar Games services may be down, you'll need to wait for a few hours and the issue will resolve by itself. Or you can submit a support request through this page here, and the Rockstar Games can help you resolve this issue. But sometimes it's not you, the issue may be on the end. The Rockstar game server servers may be down. You'll need to wait for a few hours and the issue will resolve by itself. You can check the service status as you can see right now. All services are operational and their servers are not down. So maybe you can try to reach out to them by opening a support request here. The page will be available on the description of this video. Also, this page here, make sure to select here, submit a request to contact their support team for Rockstar games. So thank you so much for watching this video and I hope this has helped you and I'll see you next time.